hey guys my name is Prem and in this video we are going to design interactive site navigation uh, so without wasting any further time let's get started all right so let's choose a frame for now uh, let's maybe design our custom frame and this would be the resolution of it all right so i'll name, name it as screen so let's give this a background color of this maybe and now uh, for, uh, in order to make a side navigation let's choose a frame again and uh, we will give this a height of same as the frame as the main frame so this would be our color for it i'll just align it center center left so uh, this is my logo so i will just paste it right here now in order to make those uh, nav links uh, we'll make a component for it let's uh, create maybe some music music and this this is the icon for it so as uh, you can see that i do have this icon and icon component set uh, and these are the components these are the icons that you can see so i will just select these two and click on shift a so now i have an auto layout of it so we'll just name this as nav link and i'll also give this a fill fill of the same color and uh, I'll choose this So now we have an icon in this the title for it the nav title for it okay so i will also need something like this a rectangle so i'll do what i will choose this absolute position and just click on this right align and just curve it for now and give this the same background So now what we will do is that we will duplicate this one uh, for now uh, at first we will not have any kind of uh, what we say this uh, something to highlight so after that we will have this one and uh, now let's change the color of it and yes We'll select all both of these and uh, after selecting uh, let me also change the color of this 
all right so let's select both of these and uh, click on component uh, create multiple components and uh, combine as variants so now we have this default version and this would be on whole version so we do have this component for now let's just take an instance from this so as you can see that we do have this instance and uh, we now have to uh, duplicate this but you know but before that let's just name this as title or maybe nav title to be the uh, to, to be very specific and let's also name this as nav title so as you can see that it is already changed here so um let's click on uh, shift a so it is also on auto layout so name this as nav links so now we will duplicate this as you can see that we don't have any issue after that we'll just uh, decrease this from a to zero and i'll just swap the icons from uh, for now filter this and i'll duplicate once more and this collapse I will collapse it later on but let's just create things for now cart and uh, filter and uh, trending so let's do one thing and let's just uh, prototype it first this would be on hover maybe yes i think things are correct let's click on this and click on the pro type view yes i think things are working nicely uh, so now let's let's create a one instance for the for collapsing now swap this icons this to collapse and this would be collapse so this is it so now we'll select this uh, side now and we'll click on uh, will press shift a and uh, fix height to what was that 1080 and uh, we will click on this center and uh, space between I think we are losing some space here uh, so it is 277 and let me just check this all right so we have two here so yes I think this is fixed now so in order to make those uh, collapsible uh, side nav uh, we need to do one thing uh, let's get this out from there and let's duplicate this one uh, now what we need to do we need to hide the titles from here or we can also do something first let's just hide the titles for now okay the titles are now hidden
let's also scale down our logo I think we should we should size our logo to this size only this is 58.91 58.91 Well, we can also change its uh, direction but then we will have some issue with this so let's uh, let's create our one let's duplicate this icon from collapse to expand and now we will just change this change its angle from this to this okay now we have these two menus these two side navs side navs actually so we'll select these two and uh, click on create multiple components combine as variants and this would be our default and this would be our expanded view all right so we'll click on prototype and uh, we will um, select this one and just from th this to and we have th this so this is our side nav component this is our uh, nav links component this is our icons components So now let it's very easy to do things. Now let's just press Alt and uh, just grab this one and uh, left align and left center line. And now we'll just click on this. We also have to do vice versa thing for collapse. We will do this. All right, so but this is actually our collapsible and uh, nav uh, side nav actually. So I hope that this video was uh, helpful to you. And if you did like this, please give this a thumbs up so that I can make similar videos for you guys. Uh, I hope you liked it and uh, thanks for watching this video. Oh, 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 oh,